Pranks and practical jokes are serious business. This video, not made for kids. It's 1993 Burger King pranks funny pages with a bunch of gag joke gifts and all kinds of fun stuff here. We got practical jokes. We got some funny business. We got hijinks in our hand. There's five of these figures to this set. Here's what they look like in package if you're looking for them. And let's get them cranked open and see what we got. All right, the first thing we're taking a look at here is a full working whoopee cushion. And I don't know if I'm going to be able to blow this up. I will give it a whirl. The rubber is old. And I don't want to ruin it, really. But, I mean, you got to kind of do it, right? It came with a straw and a full-blown whoopee cushion. The little scientist big guy, he tells you how this is supposed to... Uh, Supposed to work scientifically, but we know what this is used for, right, kids? Right, adults? And what's really cool is I open one of these things up. This is super neat. This little, like, funny page thing is like the funny papers. You remember the funny papers back in the day when you get used to get a newspaper delivered to your home? And I would go get the comics section. And they got some, like, uh, they got some, like, art styles after some of the, you know, existing comics here. Like, this is, like... Modeled after Spider-Man, but then they show like some of the different things that are included in here. A little hand buzzer looks like Dick Tracy or something. I don't know who these guys are here. I think these are the the Burger King big kid, the snake that jumps out at you, stuff that squirts in your mouth, little zapping. Got some more comics on the back. Look at this bogus bonus prank. I spy. Look at this, man. Pause it and read it, man. This is good stuff here. All right, well, I'm gonna give it a try. I don't know if this is going to work. We'll give it a whirl, though, here. I don't blow it up too hard. I don't want it to really... Uh, I don't want to wreck this. <laughs> this the paint's kind of sticky. I don't know what's going to happen here. The seams are old. I don't know if I'm just going to blow it apart. So I didn't fill it quite as much as I would like. But if you were to sit on it, let's see if we can get some noise to come out of this thing. Ready? <laughs> Excuse me? the classic hand buzzer look at this boomers buzzer comes just like you see it with the burger king livery and all that now if you had a child's hand you could actually slip this over a finger but since i'm an adult with sasquatch hands uh it's not gonna fit on my pinky but you can see you know how this is supposed to work you would conceal it in your hand and you walk up to an unsuspecting buddy and say hey nice to see you sir and you do one of these and what happens here is you got to load this up first of all. So there's a spring in here, and it seems to be still working. And you kind of got to wind it this way. And I think when you push on this, it activates the buzzer. Uh, a little bit different than a normal traditional hand buzzer. And a normal traditional hand buzzer, I don't even know if it does it really. It just kind of vibrates and goes. Brrr. This thing does a little bit different. I kind of like kind of like this style that they're going for here. Because as you push down on it, look at that. See a spin? Yeah, man, they'll grind your flesh up. So not only is it a fun prank, but you might actually you might actually buzz a hole in somebody's hand. Let's see if it works. I guess let's just try it out in my hand then. I got this all loaded up. We'll do a little push right on the palm of my hand. <laughs> Next up is this old school 1990s looking remote control for, I guess, for a TV. It says KidVid on it. Like, I've never seen a remote with, like, these types of graphics on here, but whatever, man. So I guess what you're supposed to do is, this is like a water gag. You fill this thing with water somehow. I don't know where. I don't know where you would fill this, but it does have a hole in it. And it's meant to squirt, so... I think you just squeeze the whole body of this thing, and it squirts in your face. So you give it to your buddy. You're like, hey, man, change the channel for me, would you? And you throw, toss him one of these. Unsuspectingly, he's going to go, gee, man, how the heck does this work? It doesn't seem to be. Ah! 
and, he, and it squirts right in his eyes, right in his face, and you laugh. You laugh on the other side of the room. Ha! I got you, you fool. <laughs> Next up is Lingo's Gumballs. Ooh, these look appetizing. I could go for some gumballs, couldn't you? And that's when you, that's when you give it to your buddy. You're like, hey, man, want some gumballs that I got from Burger King? From the big club? And they're like, absolutely, sure. Now, this one came packaged with a little with a little protective thing on it here so it doesn't shoot off, shoot off. As you can suspect, I hope I don't get blasted in the eyes with this or this little toy ruins my camera. But you're supposed to just... <laughs> I don't know what... <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Ah! <laughs> so as you can see, he comes with a snake. This is a, there's a big spring in here. It's not that strong and it's kind of old, but it's, this is neat, man. I'm, I'm totally digging, totally digging this set right here. It, let's see if it was actually like, <laughs> it shoots out enough. It doesn't spring in like, a t <laughs> I guess, it, I guess you could get it going pretty good. This is awesome, man. Like, that's cool. You want it to go flying out, right? Right in someone's eyes. So <laughs> I'm having too much fun with this. But this is a great, this is a great little set here, man. I'm totally digging. I'm totally digging this set. All right, next up, we got a realistic looking spider. I mean, this thing looks absolutely stupid. <laughs> He's a cartoon. He looks like a cartoon spider. And it's enormous. If you got spiders this big in your house, you got issues, man. You must be living in the Temple of Doom or something, if you know, if you get that reference. But he's got he's got the mean eyes, the underbite with the fangs. Look at this thing. And as you can see, he's got a clear tube coming out his butt. And you got Jaws giving you the A-OK, -okay, the big wink. He's like, you ready to go? You ready to do this, buddy? Because we're going to do it. So I think what is meant to happen here is that you put the spider down and someone walks in the room and says... Oh, you didn't scare me. That's not real. It's phony as can be. But what you do here is you hide somebody. You hide someone just, just off, off camera here. You, <laughs> or in this case, in life, it would be like you know under a desk or a table or something. And they're ready, man. They're ready for. They're ready to hit the hit the button. And then the, when said person comes up and starts poking fun at your gag, you get them with this. 1993 Burger King pranks funny pages. What a cool set, man! Hunt this one down and get some little jokes. I especially like the snake and the gumball thing. I think that one's the coolest. I think that was the coolest. Uh, of course, the whoopee cushion, also a classic, a little classic there for you. And you guys are a classic audience. Love you to pieces. Thank you so much for tuning in. I'm Mitch Santona for Drive Through Toys. Take her easy, people. Arriva Derchies, and I'll see you in the next one.